<laughs> I forgot. Ooh, cool. That's an interesting. Her name is Stardust. <laughs> That's cool. I've got another version of her I've been working on, but that one I just finished earlier today. Right now. Yeah, I'll have to come out now. And. Nope, I already scared of this story. Oh, I'm happy with that. That's good. Yeah, the game looks fine on my end. Okay, so it like started jumping this afternoon. And it could, or this morning, and it could just have just been. Well, I'm happy to it because I unlocked the AN94 on uh, Modern Warfare. I never knew there, there was a hyper burst on the thing. See, that's how much accuracy they try to go for for these weapons. Streaming now. I'll stream on TV, kid. I'll have a chat up. I think I'm streaming today, but I think I'll stream tomorrow. I always just live at the same time. <laughs> You know, I have P. I have PS Plus, like actual online. We could play Battlefront 2 together, but I don't have the online. Whenever you get that value, of course we can play Battlefront 2 together. I'll be rushed as fuck though. <laughs> That's fine. I'll carry you on Battlefront 2. I don't know, I just need to know. I don't know, I need to know. What's the way I'm looking for? Watch your partner. Oh, that's unpleasant. I'll be up with. See, I'll carry you. But hopefully you're not too heavy. Keep digging, keep digging. Take a little bit into it. If you get my joke, though. I'm getting it to you by shoveling it. I got my friend here.
I just took care of that. <laughs> I just shovel shit. <laughs> I was like, yeah. <laughs> yes. It's <laughs> official. She's a muckraker. A muckraker. Yeah. It's a term from the 1920s referring to reporters who like to do tabloid articles on people. Oh. So like today, yeah. That's old news is anymore. Mm -hmm. I don't know how my mythicality based stat got higher than my moxie. I don't know what the fuck happened here. We're gonna change <laughs> that. I wonder I'm fucking 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 because it was on sale on the Xbox store. I'm sure that was fun. You could have one anyway. It was 20 bucks. Uh, I think you should get that Saul Peter from Fort Cowardice. Alice reminds me of those nuns still need their treating of their relics. Ask for another suggestion. I guess that's all. Okay. Not so glad. Let's see. I guess we can go. Discovered Snake Spring. Go there now. Like, that was where I was supposed to go that I got distracted. <laughs> That's easy for you. I get distracted easily. Like, ooh, there's a kitty. Grab a big snake. I uh, shoot the snake. <laughs> Don't shoot the sticky. He did nothing to you. No, I just do this over and over again. Look. Cool, look. Gaining EXP. Boom. Oh, that's cool. Ow. Snake living. Ah. <laughs> Snake bit you. What are you doing? Leveling up my moxie so this becomes easier. Cause I should- I- I am supposed to have- I am supposed to have better moxie than this and I have more mythicality. You're not supposed to do that. So what I'm trying to do, you <laughs> can't do that. Like D and D like stats is funny as fuck. <laughs> oh, I know what system are you using? Yeah, I've seen that in uh There's a pick thing game on uh, Newgrounds, uh, mm. and this is just like it. Uh, except the storyline and character design is a little bit different. Yeah. I mean, the stick figure design allows for some easy animation. <laughs> Especially if you're using a low end software. Yeah. That's a fun game. Well, you can get the game to run on basically any computer you can buy nowadays, even the real. Like a fifty dollar piece of crap laptop. Well, the pick game I was talking about, um, or stick it, stick world game, well, like, like, is uh, Flash Yeah, the I'm trying to remember the name of uh, it's a floppy. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, I'm trying to remember the name of a text adventure that's a floppy disk from the '80s, but I can't. It's like this game, you know, it's all text based. I just can't remember the name of the fucking thing. It, it came on a green floppy disk, if that's any help. Because green floppy disks were sort of rare. This one is 
I just got one. Oh. Oh, let's see. This is also just a good place to get the XP because then I can just sit here and do this over and over. I was which size disc was it? Because I was just got a picture of the disc and I would look like. So do you guys like my border? Or do you think that's it's too weird? I like it. It's good. Hey, you can make a border for everybody. That'd be cool. <laughs> How would I apply my border? It was a three. It was a three and a half inch sloppy, sloppy disc. It was green. Remember what year it came out? Uh, early 80s. It was like when the it was early 80s, three and a half inch floppy disk. The only green. one that I can think of that was a text-based adventure game was called Fist. Just show me it and I'll see if it's the one I'm thinking of. Oh, hang on, I'm trying to find an active link to it. Uh, <clears throat> um, uh, because we used to have a box full of old floppy disk games from Little. Did you guys see the video I posted mm -hmm. when um, we're playing games? Oh. Did you get another copyright fucking claim, Alicard? Yeah, but it was easily removed. <laughs> they removed it themselves, though. <laughs> that's the hilarity of it. I'm getting sick. And uh, whenever I play Swear to or if it plays a song that's from the movies, I, I have to basically mute the song. Oh, it yeah, works. works. But it's the only way I can get rid of it. They don't do it. Where, where, where the fuck? There are a lot of things in this dude. Just a lot of things I have not checked in this place. I'm gonna go through each one. It wasn't another copyright claim. It, it was the same one that I, uh, that I submitted for review. That that first one came back saying that they they still believe that they have every right to claim it. But almost immediately after, I got that email saying that the claim was released. Oh yeah, I, I I saw that when you uploaded it. I saw I watched that when I you uploaded it, man. Or the one that had the copyright claim. You follow my YouTube? I don't think so. You might have to send me the link. Ah. But um. Okay. Yeah, that's really what the COD 2020 teaser quote unquote is for the game. I don't understand why these snakes have monsters. No, we're, we're gonna take care of this. I am. Take care of it. My image. Hey, I got I got 30 subs now. Hooray for YouTube! Mm. Fuck this, I'm just gonna click on any one of my videos and just copy the URL for that. That way it'll be easier. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, it was interesting, right? Like I said, that, that thing popped up out of nowhere. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, just click on that to lead you to my channel. Well, I think Zork is what I'm thinking about. Oh. Here. Four. I can't get any snake skin from this, but I can get... Bathrooms, dude. Come in a green floppy disk. That's what I'm trying to figure out. 
Okay, so I'm done here. I think it is. My briefcase full of snakes. I have 40. Extract some venom. Extract all the venom. So basically, the game just gave me a place yeah. where I could get. In some more regions, it did come with a green puppy, this, so it probably is it. Thank you, man. I didn't know you were okay. I think it was Zork. I don't know which Zork it was. It was either one, two, or three. I don't know which one. Can someone tell me what the latency is? Uh, um, you're fine. Okay. Five seconds. Okay. Like it, it's it's standard. You, you know, five to ten seconds. You can do it's fine. Hey, it's when you get above. In seconds, you start to get a little more. So let's see. <laughs> I've got my briefcase full of snakes, and then I now just turned into uh, basic venom vials and snakes. Yeah. And... Yeah, that's the game. Okay. I just don't know which Zork it was though, because it says all three yeah. are distributed in. I just have to play each one, the floppy version, and see which one's which. As I well, remember, which I'd be able to tell. Technically, they're all part of the same storyline. Um, there are true. Well, you know, like I, I, I only played one of the games, so I'd have to play oh, yeah. each one to be able to tell which game was the one I played. So you guys want to know? Basically. Got the creepy whispering stuff. Hey, I got, I got 30 subs! Woohoo! This rock is Sorry, really happy. whispering up a storm. It's some kind of weird dialogue you can barely understand, though. Oh, wait, no, it just has a thick accent. Is all listen more closely? I'll just cock your eyebrows. Are you sure you want to listen to that thing? Yes. <laughs> Sounds all Australian. <laughs> is it Australian? Sorry. Oh, you guys want to carefully listen to the stone. Over the course of a few minutes, it whispers. Resolve into its comprehensible English. The stuff the stone whispers Thanks, is man. pretty boring. It's mostly trivia. I got, GL I got certain stuff. Of te the geology no. of Tennessee. Meaningless to you. I'm happy. Planning a trip soon. I might want to get 50 by the end of the year. I might. <laughs> and I'm hoping to get 100 followers on Twitch by the end of the year. So this is more oh, I'm glad I could help. Oh, you can. I think that they're, they're doable goals, they're not crazy. Well, if you go to, uh, If you go back to this, uh, Discord server, put your link in self-promotion, and just give a brief description of what kind of games you play. People will actually- Which server? The one that- The new one? one? Yeah. So you guys want to know something funny about today? <laughs> so, um, there was a whole Easter egg hunt today for the COD teaser. Oh, thank you! And thank you, Hazaya. You're welcome. There was a. Are you trying a, to bond uh, <laughs> are, you, are, you, are you trying to out soup me? <laughs> so, uh, there was a code that they had to solve by clocks. Anyone know what it came out to say? Not a clue. You have no life. That's <laughs> not what it said to say. No, it said, Fish, you were here. <laughs> That's what it was. I mean, I can send you the view, Zion. It's funny. It's literally, it's literally so fish, you were here. Shit, 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 shit. Don't, don't kill me, don't kill me. Oh, okay. That was... Really? That was... stressful. Okay. Um... Why are you smiling? I am this soon. Cluster to all scraps. Downloading a terabyte game takes a fucking while, doesn't it? <laughs> Just stand here. And why I say a terabyte? Oh, yeah. While I fucking I'm kill myself. I'm downloading the game. Yeah, it's a, it's a current gen game. It's gonna have a billion updates, isn't it? 
Yeah. Are you yeah. talking about Zork? Uh, I'm talking about the Xbox guy. I bought an Xbox One game today. Oh, okay. Um, cool. Your wife I can handle it. I don't think mine would. What am I doing? Ah, my wife. My wife is negative a second, so it's not spectacular, but it it works. It gets where you, you can stream and play and everything. Yeah. I don't really need anything more than 50 megabits to be able to do that crap. Yeah. Unless you're like a pro gamer. No, I literally had the win button the entire time. And I'm sitting here, struggling. Two, 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 three. <laughs> I had the motherfucking one button. Oh, you haven't sold any of did you? That thing's a motherfucking one button. I have the bone saw, which basically works, I... instantly takes out these enemies. You just have... but I'm Why didn't you use the fucking wind button? I don't know, I just sat there shooting at it and I'm like, wait a minute. I have the fucking never mind. <laughs> yeah, look you at this, this is why she was a fish thing. You are walking no, this is why she... funnily. <laughs> Ministry is chilly walks. Here we come. <laughs> uh, I got She's the... a fan of Monty Park. <laughs> See, I told you. Mm -hmm. Alright, okay, so <laughs> there we go. There are these. Uh -huh. Sorry, now I have one extra. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I don't have pants. No. <laughs> it's no pants Monday. <laughs> I gotta. Oh, I gotta get rid of what? Potato man. What? It's Tuesday. You lying, potato man. Tuesday for you, just a Monday for us. Well, no. Hey, it is Tuesday, Tuesday for us. <laughs> oh, oh, for me, anyways. You lying, potato man. You lying, potato man. It is also Tuesday for me. The potato, the potato man lies. Laden, not Laden, I'm, I can't speak today. You children, do not trust the potato man. You will try to say it's not there when it is today. Because I lying, potato man. The, the professor's house. <laughs> Uh, some citrus, oh, water power. Plug it up. Cool, you got 15 EXP. Awesome. Why did you, did you sound, you sound like Beavis doing Bungholio? What do you mean? <laughs> There's no reason for that. Excuse me, my name's Titani. Oh, I didn't notice you come in. I'm not used to visitors, but gen people... But folks ge generally call me the professor. There's something I could do for you. Well, I found this beeping gizmo. I kind of followed the beeping, and it led me here. Well, I'll beep. You, it certainly led you to the right place, young lady. This is the. Hey. Uh, this is what? Did he find Pringles? <laughs> no. He <laughs> 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 did, though. <laughs> So, well, I found this beeping gizmo and it sort of called the beeping and it led me here. Well, I'll be. It certainly led you to the right place, young lady. This, oh, this is El Vibrato technology. It ha- Why would you call- Never mind. <laughs> technology. I, and I happen to be as much of an ex- I, As much an ex- Wow. Much an expert as anyone alive today. El what? El Vibrato, they were an ancient race that lived here long before humans. Well, they mostly lived underground, so they might still be living, as far as I know. Never seen a peep of an actual person, though. Just machines they left behind. So were they space aliens? Could be aliens, could be genius pre-humans, or an entirely different terrestrial evolutionary line. At this stage of the investigation, it's impossible to say it. Isn't it exciting? Here, let me have a closer look at your beeping gizmo field device. As I suspected, it's one of their transponders. It detects other L vibrator technology and homes in you see. That's why it led you here. I've got a thing I've been trying to repair. He tinkers around with the transponder for a bit and plugs it into a strange stone. Marble into a socket. Wow. The, they're 
There you go. Good as new. Just swipe down and turn it turn it on or off. You gotta swipe. I gotta warn you, this device will lead you to in an abandoned vibrator technology, but it might attract unwanted attention. From what? From the L vibrator technology! Technology? What? <laughs> You'll see what I mean, just be careful. Okay. Alright, I'll give you the scraps of shit you need to research. Tell me you can see the screen. Breaking L vibrato. Yoda? Yes, that's the toilet. <laughs> can you see it, man? I'm moving into the stream right now. Yes, I see it. That's not the jest of that fuck. Yeah. Right, look at it go. <laughs> This game. I might say that. That's pretty interesting. Uh, you notice a smoldering hole in the ground and recognize its habitat oh, yeah. of, as a habitat of southeast western coal snakes. They keep in the south mostly, but they know it's a rare fight if one is thrust upon them. Thrust one upon them. I want you to try to kill me with your lightsaber. I don't know what to do I got a hologram of a rainbow. That's a young rain call. This horse has seen some shit. <laughs> Howdy. I named my horse Drugs. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same size, but it's scaled down. That's it. It's not a rain It's not an adult rain It's a, you know, a young one. Use my binoculars. So you can't see it. Rain call. Like I said, it's the same size, but scaled down. Open it. Saltpeter. Why are you doing anything with saltpeter? It's not oh, salt. Geez. Salmon one, another. I really want the details. Rebecca Lovelorn. It's like, how do you how do you want to distract your enemy? Throws a hologram of a dancing woman. Uh, there you go. We've also got this is a holo camera, so you want to make screenshots of the game. You do it with that. These are just some goodies I got. It's pretty deep. It's a nice hologram. Yeah. I like how they got. I like how they got the blue right. Hey, yeah, the blue seems right. Like, like I, I watched the. I watched the. Um, you know, the clip we could is with it, the council with the holograms, and the blue is the same color. Uh, Oh, I have two lightsabers. I have my new lightsaber, which is my character constructed for this part of the game. And the character I got when I was a Padawan. Which is my green one. Oh, anyway, he has two lightsabers. There you go. That blade is shorter and a bit more stubby, but it's still a full-size lightsaber. This one's a longer blade. Wonder blade! Muscle. Okay. I got a flare gun. I, f I, I got the flare gun for a reason. When you shoot the flare gun off, your any people will see it, so I can just shoot it off if Paige needs to fire me. Yeah. <laughs> Seems like Paige gets lost in a lot of time. Yeah, no sense of direction. She's not going. The horse tells her in that Look regard. <laughs> I'm sorry. Look, I'm wearing armor. My Jedi is wearing armor. <laughs> no, dude, she's worse than Yapati Zeraxi. I am not. No, no. no, you have less direction than Columbus. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you don't. I know. Oh. Okay, then I have not this. Or, not, even, not even map quest is as inaccurate as her. Oh. Oh my God. <laughs> I have like many talents. Sense of direction is a wild. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look. 
we just need a very good, we just need the best GPS money can buy, and it'll be no problem. And then it's all in your brain. Okay, where are you going? This is why I'm staying silent. Okay, where are you going? I'm going where you told me to go. We're in Western Australia now. <laughs> <laughs> This is the last time I let you drive. <laughs> I'm not going, wait, I'm going to the let's bitch. Where's the most haunted place on the planet? We're not going there. You can go fuck yourself. <laughs> uh, the suicide force of Japan? What? The golden mile, no. No. The golden mile in Australia is the not most not. haunted place in the history of the planet. Because if anyone who is even Anyone who says they're a psychic and goes there disappears. No one goes there. I, I, I'll give you a clue. It's where uh, there's a fuck ton of gold in the golden mile. But no one wants to dig up the gold because whenever they try to do anything, the people disappear. So in the 50s, it was just made illegal to go near that fucking place. Or anything other than driving through it. Because the only reason people go through that is to drive through it to get to another place quicker. Yeah. You don't, there is a law that you're driving through. You don't disappear. The thing is, you don't stop and you just... There is no speed limit on that road. Go. So what do people do when they drive through that? It's like, it's called the Golden Mile, but it's really like 50 miles. What do people do when they get to that part of the road that says no speed limit? Drive as fast as fucking possible? <laughs> people still disappear though. It's like, it's, like the, it's like the Bermuda Triangle of land. Uh, in a devastated Cortilla off the southern road, you see a similarly devastated scarecrow. Shirt's untucked, its hat's knocked off, and don't get me started on the state of its ascot. Why? Fix it up. So you Why actually like I... the stuff I had you look? Why is it Fred from Did you actually like this? Uh, yeah. talk to your partner. Uh, goddamn, yeah, it's just a little sand. We have to do something immediately. Any ideas? Only would think I could think to get rid of all of these things all at once would be poison them somehow. That's not very doctorly. What? You never heard of a vaccination? Look. <laughs> Look, <laughs> would you rather find an army of skeletons? No, it's used in Asia. Or find, or find a way to slip something but into their food? That's, not, that's too much used like in Asia. Alright, I'm gonna be right back. Uh, these crates are just. Oh, why skeletons even eat? Calcium. Dig through it. Not without. Si uh, okay, hold on. Yeah, they like milk. <laughs> We're gonna put this in. So avoid cowgirl cosplays. Dig through it. You got an old patrol hat. I need to keep that. Um. You got a cryptic note about ley lines. There's also evil looking bound town. Read it. It seemed to have Cool. Uh. There are skeletal right. A ma this is a mass grave. This mass grave is absolutely teeming with those skeletal riflemen. They don't seem to be interested in getting out, but you could definitely jump in there if you were in for a fight. There's one wandering in the end of the pit nearest you. Fight! Mortal Kombat. And when Where's the character? Do not steal. Got an item instant grits. I slightly changed his sprite color. Original character. Do not steal. Fuck, I hate this planet! <laughs> then why you want it? Cause I have to be on it to do the deal saying I hate this planet! 
It's the suckiest planet in the game. Oh, it was like that Moxie failed. There we go. The moment I get the fuck out of the movie. Thank oh, fuck, God. I only have to go here once. Let's get the hell out of here. Speed running across the universe. Look inside. Oh, that's not there's a diary. Super dude. cool. Super 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 cool. He and several others were reanimating dead soldiers here on the theory that the best undead army would be literally. There's nothing wrong with being a cultist. <laughs> Depends on the cult. <laughs> the best undead army. I'm a cult. What are, you, what are you laughing? The best undead army would literally be an undead army. <laughs> the hitch in the plan came when they raised the officers decide they weren't going to take orders from a bunch of weirdo civilians. <laughs> what? Well, some cults are actually harmless and don't hurt any people. Sadly, that's the minority. Yeah. The majority, however... Ma <laughs> no, but it's like, I hate people that all your cults, but it's... No, there are some cults that are just... They're all about peace and not hurting anybody. But not, not hippies. hippies. Yeah. Like, I just wish there was a way to like, like get rid of the bad ones or the ones that actually are they just try and help people but don't brainwash people would they should be allowed to exist because they're basically a religion it's just they called they caused cults they called cults because mainstream religions don't like them Like they're not doing anything bad. They, they should be allowed to exist. They're just a religion. It's just religions don't want to call them a religion. Yeah, the power of them. I have a white lightsaber, so suck it. <sighs> And this is why we don't yeah. raise the dead people. <laughs> what did I tell you? What did I tell you not to do? Raise the dead. And what did you do? Raise the dead. Raise the dead. <laughs> Necromancy. It's for pansies. <laughs> so it's a necromancer in the party. That reminds me, I've got five new spells that I'm working on. Uh, strategy, privy, okay. Um, plus toilet. It's a toilet, the flush is broken, yeah, push around on it. You grab that reminds me, I need to look up that Content, again. skeletal spore. Ew. The table has a little model of the region on it. It's a giant map of the region, cool. Pokemon, Pokemon, Pokemon. Let's uh, examine it. Press eyeballs, nauseating. Taint the food with. I hate. This, this works by tomorrow. Man, you suck it. Wait, why are we poisoning their food? They, they're skeletons. They don't eat, right? Uh, there are a way to poison birds to make them brittle and com crumble, so they poison their food with that. They, they die. But they don't eat. I think they'd at least eat milk. Like, bathe in milk. And crap like that. Maybe. So, uh, there are dairy versions of Carabathy? <laughs> no, but you, it makes sense for birds to skeletons to bathe in milk. Because it would map location. It would strengthen them. I'm on Van Dean if anyone wants to know what planet that is. Help yourself. Make. Three silver bullets, make... And can suck it! I make... Uh, I turn the silver bullets into needles because I prefer lock picking. Well, give me a clue. It, 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 it has the same use as Star Wars the Bespin has. Silver plater. 
it, 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 it's full of turbina gas. It's you know they um mine turbina gas on Bespin. That's what they do on Vidin. But the problem with Bespin is nice and controlled by someone who is sane. Vibian is not. Because the planet isn't just a gas giant, it, it's also been nuked. But you, you imagine a nuke filled gas planet? Excuse me. Oh. Uh, Mom's going to take all your dolls and brush their hair because that's what my grandmother did with mine. All of them. <laughs> your spit 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 at least it looks like a spit next to the bed. It, it might actually be a bedpan. Investigate it. What? Really? I mean, if it is just a spittoon, that's bad enough, but I'm. it might be a bedpan. Oh, it would be way Stop worse. It. Investigate it. I feel like you aren't getting what I'm saying here. We're talking about an object that someone probably uses when they wake up in the middle of the night and can't be bothered to walk out. To the outhouse. The best thing to for it is that they may be only, is maybe the only use it as a spit nighttime, is a spit nighttime tobacco juice into, in which case it's like full of rancid congealing tobacco spit. I'm investigating it. Are you even listening to me? Are you, or are you just some sort of, or are you just sort of skimming past the text? Bedpan. I'm pretty sure there's a treasure in here and you're not stopping me. Bedpan. Shut up. I'm investigating. <laughs> oh, okay, fine. That's Have it your way. Your, your own filthy, disgusting way. It turns out it probably it turns out to probably not be a bedpan, but it's definitely spittoon. It's one of those rotting brown spit. What is wrong with you? Oh, you <laughs> oh good god, okay, you plunge your hand in up to the wrist. Oh makes god. A loop sound, breaks the, the thin skin, you know, they and <laughs> uh, I'm fighting Cortesis, but assassin droids. Oh, I see. Basically, but you know the. It's okay. Basically, you imagine a bunch of magma gods that are made of Cortesis. Um. These things fucking won't die. They sound like they won't oh, they die. Do. Oh, they're like, uh, they're, they're like, the, you know, in some RPGs, there's really tough, like, they're common enemies, but they're, like, tough. Uh -huh. oh, but you're they're not bosses, they're just tough. No, okay. Okay. You okay. hung your hand in up to the wrist, it makes a gloop noise, and it breaks the thin skin after dealing toxins that was previously keeping the dire smell in relative check. Now you're choking on a miasma of oily, bitter, chaw stink. You know the feeling you get when you're about to puke, and how you get that taste way back in the rear corner of your mouth, the metallic tang on the roof of your tongue, that, like you're sucking on a throated old penny. Let's tell me what I found already. You have found a filthy, slime-colored old brooch. Are you happy? I bet you're going to put it on without even washing it first. Maybe I will, so there. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I'm stubborn enough to probably do that. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I'm just stubborn enough. Okay, so. No endangering your life. Uh, where's where is it? The silver plater. There we go. Uh, for a rock at that trick. A loud Heat off cliff and draws die. Draws your attention. You follow the sound of a man once in a once white apron who's butchering a big horn sheep or some other desert large desert animal with an oversized heavy looking meat cleaver. He's hauling as he's hauling the implement up to his shoulder for another blow, he catches the side of you and hisses. Who's there? Don't test me draw, I'll chop you up like this goat or whatever it is. Trick him out of his carcass. <laughs> Hold on, is it, look at the horns. That's a blue crested mountain goat. What? They're super endangered. Only only, there's only like a dozen of them left. Ain't surprising, they're real tasty. No, look, it's wildly illegal to kill these. If the marshals catch you, it's years in the slammer. You better run and get out of here before anyone... Get out of that bloody carcass before anyone spots you. I'll bury the carcass. Bloody apron, whatever. 
uh, I can't speak today, and I'm not gonna try. But sure, thanks to you. Uh, the English teach you can't speak English, everybody. Fuck you. <laughs> uh, Ladies. Ladies. What the fuck I just missed? Louise! <laughs> Honey, we're on stream. We're not, we're, not, we're not that kind of stream, are we? Fuck you. Sure, why not? Uh, I'm gonna help you try to leave the stream, run! <laughs> Alright, I guess I can speak that one. Leaving you with as much meat as you can carve off this, whatever it is. Funny for me. Awesome. No, I'm not. The last time, I don't want your door to do a punch in the face. The menu? What are you talking about? Isn't this a walk up style restaurant? No, I'm a silver plater. I play things with silver. Oh, I thought your side was. Never mind. <laughs> what am I offering? Ah, uh, remember the time Portuguese. Did you remember the time when Portugal discovered platinum and dumped it in the ocean because they thought it was worthless? What? Yeah. For what three hundreds? Portugal discovered a mine full of platinum, filled it full of their boat, then dumped it when they came across a pirate ship full of gold. They dumped all the platinum in the sea for about half as much gold. Oh. That's sad. <laughs> Fucking idiots. And guess who came along? Guess who came along? Of the world. And, and guess who came along and recovered the wreckage? Australia. We took all the platinum. No, Spain. <laughs> rain and plane is. Rain is. Sorry, but um. Portugal was dumb for doing it. Like, What's this metal? It's worthless. That's a good idea. I like that hat you're wearing. <laughs> one maximum action point. Sure. Uh, what else can you play? That Spain uh, just comes uh, along and just. <laughs> What are my options? Uh, that's funny. Uh, plate my melee weapon. What else can you plate? What are my options? Yeah, I'll plate the pistol. Um. I don't mind putting it away. I can plate your tongue. Or holding Jennifer, whichever. Plate the turn. Oh, yeah, so just. Hey, During Billy. my stream, uh, if, uh, if Billy, uh, not Billy, uh, Kyle was there, how much you want to make a bet he will be making constant jokes about Yusuke's Persona Goemon? Um, all the time, but, um... <laughs> I haven't done Cyber Slift yet, I'm waiting for you to finish it, man. Okay. You're caught up the way while I'm just waiting until... Oh, I was talking about Persona. Yeah, I heard what you said. Just... Persona stream right now. Yeah, I'm just saying that about Cyber Sleuth because I'm just each time you do the stream, they watch the stream and get up the way you were themselves. So. Alright, so... Okay. I like watching you play it because it's fun. And I, anyway, I'm going to finish it before you finish the stream. will kind of be less fun watching it. There. <laughs> and then once, uh, once I'm done with Cyber Sleuth, and the Saturday after that, after that's completed, we'll, we'll be going into Hacker's Memory. Yeah, that's right. I'm still Good oh, game. Uh, I want people to go, oh, the Switch games look bad, aren't as good looking as the PS4 or. Xbox One ones, it's like, you bought the Switch one because you wanted it portable. Shut up. Gives you, give me skulls. To be able to make it portable, they kind of have to cut the features or they have to cut the graphics a bit. Whatever, Grandma. Yeah, yeah. Go play Doom in the 90s and just try and get 30 frames. Lost that one have been uh, my reason for getting it if I never had it. So it's like people go, oh, 
I hate those people who just think, oh, if, it's, if it can't do, if the game isn't 60 frames a second, it's bad. Brain usually can't tell between 50 and 60 frames per second unless you're actually actively trying to see it. It might notice a slight difference, but it's not going to be jarring. And other people go 100 frames per second. Your brain can't perceive 100 frames per second. Your eyes. Your brain will see it. Your eyes won't. The human mind can't. The human eyes can't see above 80 frames per second. So I, I don't understand. Those people who think, oh, I get 100 frames. The only reason you need hot frames that high is if you're playing a competitive online game. Yeah. If you're and not. Digimon's not uh, uh, online competitive. Exactly. If it was online competitive, it's turn based. Yeah, just it'd like, be like Pokemon. It'd be like It'd be like Pokemon, basically. Who gives the fuck about the frame rate? All you care about is just the freaking. Because the online connectivity works. Okay, I hate those PC master race morons. I like PC gaming, but I'm not a PC master race because I still go and play my Xbox. I still buy all the consoles, it's just if they have a ver if the PC port of a game that's on another on one of the consoles is better, I get the PC port. My family always owned all the consoles, it's usually um instead of like one of us owned the Wii. I don't it's like one of a because it's three siblings, one of us would get one of the consoles. Then we split it. And this is the way we did it was the person who has the console gets priority, but everyone can play each other's consoles. In games, it's just you have to do exchanges. Yeah. Huh. I have huh. like the same amount of time. Yeah. So if someone plays my Xbox for three hours, you get to play the, my brother's GameCube for three hours, and I'm glad you got hit. You know, I think I'm gonna head off to bed because I'm starting to get tired plus I have to be a bit early today. Alright, good night. Alucard. Good night. I'll go dig up a grave just for a freaking uh, secret recipe. Um, hit, you see a covered wagon and a small family of settlers who look upset. We're on our way to dirt water, but our wagon went and broke. Oh, that's rough. You're liable to get attacked by bandits out here, or snakes, or coyotes, or ghosts, or other things that basically live exclusively on that live exclusively on stranger. That does look bad. Uh, isn't there anything you can do to help us? Uh, give them a ride to dirt water. I'll give you a- wait a minute, you got two horses hitched to this wagon, why don't you just ride the horses? What? You do know how to ride a horse, don't you? Just to dirt water? But these are cart horses. Oh, for the love of... Help them ride back to dirt water. Dirt water! It's like, you can ride the horses! They're cart horses! You can still ride the horses! Dave J. You dig up the grave, pry open the coffin, and instead of a corpse, it contains a garbage bag. Strange. You reach inside. You reach inside. The garbage bag is full of pudding. Not just pudding. Pudding. Pudding and mortar oil. Who would do this? Finally managed to reach all the way to the bottom of the bag. Retrieve a sodden lump at the bottom and glob the wad, dry it off, and then wash your arm in the nearby ditch. It better be. This better be worth it. You got an item. Dave's secret sauce recipe. Uh, I've already played poker. Uh, 
Uh, got that recipe yet? The one my jerk friend Dave took to his grave? Yeah, I got it. Uh, thanks a million, buddy. Now my slot, but we'll be world famous. Game to you. 10 EXP. Here, let me give you something for all your trouble. I have to fill in the slot, but it's still good. Thanks. Plus three Moxie. I'll just get this little thing too. Plus three Moxie to the hat. Mm. Plus six Moxie. Mm. Huh. And then. I love you too. I love you too. I, I need, you ever have it to where your neck is stiff and you want to pop it and it won't? Mm. Yeah. I yes. I hate it. Thanks. You owe me a potato. Hold your nose and fight it. Uh. Great Western Turtle Snake. Turdlet Snake. Okay. you to plate my hat. Order my options, plate your hat. Done. Nacho taco waffle. Um that the store. Oh cool, I actually made it there for once without getting without a random encounter. <laughs> okay, so I got the artillery saber and that I'll sell. Um, the fake Pope hat. Because that's not blasphemous. Um, I already got this. What else can I sell? I think that's all. What's she got? Mm, nothing of use. Okay. Peace. Um,. I guess I'll go to the railroad camp. Um, you hear a rattling noise behind you, another rattling no noise off to your left, and a third rattling noise off to someone ahead. You conclude that you've either stumbled into a nest of babies or a nest of rattlers. Quickly a quick glance confirms the latter. Not unexpectedly, this is no place for babies. Um, well... Not getting much track laid, but she's an expert whistler. You approach the beleaguered looking man in the tiny glasses. Howdy there, who's in charge of this outfit? If I'm being charitable, I'd say the fellow over there with the white hat is the foreman. He points to the man next to a huge pile of rocks. And if you're not, he smiles. Then I'd say that paper backed idiot over there in the absurd white hat is the fellow you're looking for. Alrighty, thanks. Hi, are you in charge? I was wondering if there's anything I could do to help. You want to know something? I love trains. Oh? Ever since I was a boy, a huge, magnificent, roaring iron beast. They're magical to me like dragons when the opportunity arose to take on men in front of this rail line. 
I've jumped on it like a shot. You know what I learned? What's that? Organizing and building and running one of those things, these operations, is the most amazing pain in the ass you'll ever imagine. You want to help? Congratulations, <laughs> you're the new foreman. I'm going home to play with my models. <laughs> uh, I guess I'm, I guess I'm the boss now. Man, let's you Sounds like you got the shaft. Yeah. <laughs> well, suppose it can't be any worse than the, than that last clown. He extends his hand. Name's me. I'm your assistant. What's the situation? Well, I'm sure you didn't miss seeing the giant pile of rocks block in our path. I love this game, and I hate this game. Because every part of me wants to dip down into the southern accent that I don't like having. Get in the bee. <laughs> oh, I it's, it's annoying. Well, I've got a half moon outside. Problem is, it'll take. <laughs> Wait, you have like a printer, man. Well, my by my calculations, we could we could dynamite it clear without too much trouble. Problem is, it'll take a lot of dynamite, a whole year's worth, I figure. We could we used to keep that much on hand for emergencies such as this one, but a pack of goblins stole it all. Sneaky little varmints! I'll get it back for you. Glad to hear it. Those goblins are holed up in Gustavossum? What the fuck is it? Never mind. Gulch, it's a real rough place. You might want to spend some time getting the lay of the land and honing your fighting skills before you head that way. Especially if you plan to go in guns blazing. Discover a new map location. You don't need that specific dynamite, though. Any you can lay your hands on will be fine. So as long as there's enough of it, I'll look into it. And I could get it from the dynamite person over there for like 5,000 meat, but I said, fuck it, I'm gonna go kill things. Um, <laughs> investigating the smoke of a nearby campfire, you find a bandit snoozing cozily beneath a large colorful quilt, which seems like a strange choice of camping gear, right? And then he wakes up, jumps to his feet, re revealing that the large colorful quilt is actually a large colorful quilted Ooh. pair of pants. In stark contrast with his whimsical pants, he's undeniably hostile. Distract him and steal his gun. Quick, a lizard or a spider or something that went up your pant leg. Oh no, my pants are so big and soft and quilted I can't even notice. Exactly, do something fast. The quilt quickly, the, the bandit quickly unbuckles his gun belt and in his haste to take off his pants and get the jawstrings knotted up, he ends up rolling around on the ground. Fran frantically, you pick up his gun and stroll away. <laughs> nice. I got a gun. I don't need that one. Um, uh, fancy goblins to forward. Hello, being a mayor, welcome. Now, going away, please. This goblin seems friendly, but blocked your entry into the gulf. Talk to the goblin? Can I not coming in? Sorry, only for goblins being very private. Trick him until you think. Hey, though, outside the court, I seen a thing you liking a lot. What thing? What thing do you liking a lot? Mm, pies? There are pies all over out there. This seem this seeming dubious, but be neglectful not to being not to check. I hate this. He takes up work out of his pocket and leaves. Cool, I told him there was, I told them there was pie everywhere and yeah, I'm awesome. <laughs> I want cheesecake. I want cheesecake. One tacos. It was sad, I haven't had Taco Bell in three weeks. Wow. So I watched my fourth meal. Potato uh, man! Uh, go potato man and potato then. Hello, I'm lost by 10, which means he is weaker to being shot. And I'm going to shoot him, so. Uh, yeah. No. You dig through the crates, the goblin was rummaging through, but there's nothing of interest in any of them. Fuck. <laughs> Library. 
<sighs> Sorry, excuse me. You listen at the door. It's quiet inside. Go inside. It's a shack filled with crude bookshelves. The bookshelves, in turn, are filled with crude books. The three titles catch your attention. So very complicated numbers. How to bird noise. Alice going in to a seeing glass. Okay, so what is this supposed to- You can tell this book is, is- You can tell about this book that it concerns extremely high level mathematics. You don't have the vocabulary to understand any of it. Probably still wouldn't if it was written in English. Your brother probably would love it. Browse more. How is your book noise? Alright. And this book is extremely detailed treatise on the sounds that different birds make. You probably wouldn't expect to learn how to do an accurate, great, crested, grabby impression from a book, but that's how detailed it is. Uh, Alright, stop. So... Listen, check inside, lock pick, you make sure head inside. Each you enter it seems to be a delicacin or deli. You got three goblin sandwiches. You've already raided this deli. Okay. Uh no sound coming from inside, check it out. The shack filled with thousand tiny cabinets, each labeled with a number and goblin. Looking around the door, you got a bulge goblin log. Keep looking, looking around the door. You got a goblin tent, keep looking. You got goblin trousers. And the more random drawer, still nothing, and even more random drawer. Ellie, come here. Come here. Wait, is this? Nope. Nothing. False alarm. Still nothing. Still nothing. Nothing. Still nothing. Nothing. You got a goblin pistol. Definitely the last one. Keep looking. I mean it. There's nothing left. I mean it. There's nothing. Okay. One to fifteen. Yeah. Oh, I mean these ones are. That's a range. And I just looked up. Okay, we're out. <laughs> I know, but they're like twenty, forty dollars. I can't yeah, have this on. I'm just trying to figure out what we have a lot. Because I don't want to lose Moxie. That's not what I'm talking about. You hear a couple goblins rushing out. It sounds like they're doing something really important. We have to trust them. <laughs> You can, but at least we have some men. I had like one more. Kind of. Poor kids. They have no family jewels. <laughs> there we go. They have no usable packages. Up to that back. <laughs> you came you got two Okay. I have 165. Use a fishy USP. one. Okay, quick on the draw. Lock picking expertise. We have two bells. Two more on. Play snakes. I'll save this for now until it's next. One mini moon. Uh, go in and break a leg. Head backstage. Keep watching. You gain 20 XP. One, two. Three, uh, you've already done everything you can do here. Seriously? This mayor's right? house. You can mm -hmm. check it out. You can investigate bed. And check out dust. Important secrets. Read the important secrets. The treasure in the. Just, 
drawer 6915. Which two do you want? In the storage hut. Which, that one? Oh, that one's sissy. Okay. Check inside. So that one's sissy. Mm -hmm. What other one? Okay, that one's yours. Yeah. But which one? Okay. Yeah. 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 Which one do you want? Throw it. Throw it. Here's that. Oh. Whistling a wooden bird call, but they're not too busy to beat you up if you try to pass them. Try out your new bird call skills. You're great crested in person. Oh, a great Wow, he pulls out a pair of binoculars out of his uniform and goes out. Cool, I just tricked the bird watcher into going outside. <laughs> uh, remind them of their cafe shift. Okay. Um, open up. Contains your supplies animate. Open up. Um, uh, welcome, welcome back. back. I'm out of space with welcome that sad back. look upon your face. Oh, Lord, how's <laughs> Nothing screams, I stole my boyfriend's clothes like this doll right <laughs> <laughs> I'm not kidding. <laughs> well, here, here. Look at this thing! Those clothes do not fit her. She's wearing a baggy shirt. And short. Yeah. Like, does that not scream? I stole my man's clothes. This is how you can tell he's mine. <laughs> I stole his clothes. He's mine. Get it back. <laughs> <laughs> I will, I will, I will into him a murder. Hide it. Uh. Hey, at least they're not all the Strong person. Hostility. Need all stats. Oh, okay, manifest destiny railroad. Are we there yet? Mm -hmm. 
Uh, yep, here we go. Sweet. Sweet holy hammer. The bluey. Oh, uh, no. Jermaine didn't say anything about Trinity Rock Monster. Alright. Very large, very angry looking thing. Guy standing here. Apparently a little peeved about having a year supply of dynamite blown up next to his butt while he was sleeping. <laughs> How do you want to handle this? Uh. Dance at him. <laughs> rock monsters are extremely strong, but it only matters if he can hit you. And it's geog geologically slow. Dancing around the creature, you find plenty of spaces to stick a knife, widening fractures and fissures created by the initial dynamite blast. Eventually, the entire thing just crumbles to the ground and with an angry groan. All in a day's work. Well, no, that's a fine day's work if I've ever seen. Much obliged, friend. I'll, we'll be getting the rest of the track laid and head out now. I'll mark you, our mark our route, route for you on our map in case our paths cross again. Then the Manifest Disney Railroad Company camp. Can't I just ride the train? You got a ticket? <laughs> just kidding. Of course you don't. Every seat on this train is sold out. Sorry, boss. Hey, that's not fair. I fixed it. Never mind. She never did chicken. Yes, she did. She did not. Ah, you've got her at the old medicine show. Go that way. I knew that one. Talk to your partner. Reboot Hill. Uh, okay. I asked for another. Guess it's all there is? Okay, cool. Take it, Wills. I've known. You can make it fancy. Cool. I'm all free litter. Send me another game of that. I made venomous bullet oil. That'll do. I'll do, pig. That'll do. That half moon's getting bigger. In a Barbie too, <laughs> in a Bobby world. Combat items, a liver, climbable bullet oil. Combat items, venomous bullet oil. I'm gonna, I have to go downstairs and uh, switch my laundry, but I will be right back, so stay here. Entertain them. <laughs> <laughs> Which really means you need to sleep. Sleeping 
Sleeping Beauty. Somebody's a narcoleptic. How about Sleeping Beauty? It. Oh, it's not me. Yeah. I actually do not like green. 
Four broke my heart, but three was way too dark and cynical for me. No. What the boys go through. I work tomorrow. And laundry needs to be done. Because <laughs> I need like pants. To the dump. And that was freaking evil. Why put children through that? Like, no! I can't hear people, but don't throw it away. I have to play bloody stuff. Okay. They're gonna die! Uh, here's that, here's here, they're gonna needle. Death by Kieran. What? <laughs> what? Uh. That's oh. a corner for the hell. Uh, grab it, lucky horseshoe. Uh, offhand. Six pistol attack, if that'll work. Offhand. Yeah, no, this will work. Uh, fight. Well, Seattle no longer has a police force. Uh, that's oh, interesting. Wow. Because the Seattle police chief resigned at the Democrat City Council uh, votes to cut police budget. And over a third of the police force in the city have already followed suit with the police chief. Stupid of doing that shouldn't be in the office. I'm sorry. What you do is it's not gonna cost. Like, if they think cutting budgets is gonna fix the problem that they have, like, fix the problem, it's not. It's gonna make a bad problem worse. That's what they want. Also, they can put all this on Trump. That's their plan. However, it's not working. Never has, never will. That's how stupid it is. Yeah. That's the they are their own uh, damnation. Got an infernal soul fragment. See, yeah, I told you. I'm going to destroy it. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine to win, Chester. I'm going to lose. Why can't I ever go first in this game? Increases your moxie oh, by five for the rest of the day. Uh, increases your super. I don't know if it will in that slide there. Come on, Manchester. Do something stupid. Oh, you did something I'm, stupid. I'm just... Something really stupid. What you doing? You played an elf. Uh... Uh, howdy. Man, 
time is there something I got boot? It's awful, I can't remember, I can't remember. Let's start from the beginning. You see, I had four daughters. They married four Smith boys. And after that, they each had five daughters of their own. Unfortunately, I outlived every one of them. I outlived every one of the 24 of them. Uh, you know you're a ghost, right? Yes, in fact, I died here in this graveyard where they were all buried. I came to visit them, and I suppose my whole old heart, poor old heart, finally gave out. Not a problem, though. Nine to five years is a pretty good run, after all. But you forget, I got yeah. this... Okay, a flower's one of my favorite granddaughter's grave, but I can't remember which one was my favorite. I'm so ashamed. I can't pray I like to live. Leave until I've remembered. Well, maybe I can help you. I appreciate it. No problem. Can you tell me everything here? Well, I'm certain her last name ended in a vowel. Okay, anything else? I remember I was 40 when she was born. No 37, or was it 42? It must have been somewhere <laughs> in that range. Okay, anything else? Her first name was longer than her last. Just like mine. Okay, anything else? I remember she wasn't buried next to any of my daughters. Okay, anything else? There's a little have to say with poor Becky who was always such ill health. Anything else? Oh, her favorite hobby was knitting. Maybe I left here before she died. That's all I can remember. Knitting, okay. Let me think a moment. I'll be back. Okay. Smith. Son of a Becky. Eating contest in the sky. The ground here seems reasonably soft. Dig it up. You got tripe pie. Ew. And that Santabum tried to eat her way out of a bear. Buck Jeansley. No one ever saw a man die that way before. Clean Willie Hank. Really hate this burial thing. Uh, wait in. Which of them? It. More. Evon. Sweet. Beep. This one seems to be the most place to ride.
<laughs> At first say yes, but later on it's no. Ow. That sounds like Toy Story 2 there. That's Toy Story 3. Oh. My bad. Okay. You don't want to know the truth of those movies. Like, I like them, but there's something unsettling. Yeah. I know exactly what it is, and I need to explain it. Yeah. But I don't want to do it over a live stream. And then, well, she was born when I was 40, no, 37 or 42. So, anything born in 1837 to 1842. Got okay. Her name was long, her name ended in a vowel. Her name is longer than her last. Anything else? She wasn't buried to, next to any of my daughters. Okay. She seemed to pass at the same age of poor, poor Becky, who was always in such ill health. Okay. Poor Becky. Um, I think, okay. Definitely, I need to think about and be back in a minute. Uh, 43. Uh, 1859. Somebody's getting yelled at. That's me. Lastly, smart. Oh. Stupid makes happy. Mm -hmm. All right. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello, Hello Martha. Hello, Mike. Ah, that's awful. Sorry. You sound British. You sound British. Do not try. I have never met an American who can do an Australian accent. Because I was trying. I don't, I just don't try. That's bad. A lot of dollars for every American who made a terrible accent, I'd be richer than Trump. <laughs> Nerf herders everywhere. Can we play 
I think you know who she is. Um, uh, oh no, thanks for trying. Oh no, I have to come back again tomorrow. I fucked up the month. Um, Shank means we're reasonably sure he's dead. <laughs> Adam L. I'm sorry for being gone. A friend needed me. It's okay. God, I'm coming and going. Oh, his fucking name is a. whatever that thing is. Uh, what's the. What's, what's the term? I can't figure it right now, but what's the term when a word spells something backwards and forwards the same? I'll catch you all later. Alright, bye. Later. Alright, everyone. Alright, man. Dink Scotch Turkison, drowned in a whiskey barrel. Yeah, it's what he would have wanted. The ground here seems reasonably soft. Pick it up, you got decent whiskey. <laughs> Old Dead Tom. Took us kind of a long time to get around this. Get around to this. Uh, Deeks. Couldn't remember the rhyme about which snakes are poisonous. Oh, <laughs> if this is supposed to be the American West, i.e. California, that's a good rule of thumb to know. Because king snakes or coral snakes kind of look similar. I just say stay away from snakes altogether and I'll be back. Uh... Annette Jangle, first lady bicyclist to ride off a cliff. <laughs> uh, you got riding boots. Uh, lavender creeks. The inventor of the external combustion engine. The external combustion? I can see how she died. <laughs> <laughs> it went big bada boom. I uh, got a gothic root cameo. It's new, Skitty. I'll take the Moxie versus a Steve. It'll help me. Plot two. Vernon Hensicord, professional sword swallower. Dynamite Jim Fresca, all the bits we could find. <laughs> uh, the tombstone is big and fancy as a door in the front. Open the door. It said there's a document, a little word, metal object. Read the document. B T L I T R. The document describes a ton time. Oh, this is a lovely looking spot. The burial wishes of Chet Buster Lee and the weird sequence of letters. There's a document and a metal object. Take the document. You got a key fragment. Uh, read it. B T L I. <laughs> What kind of word is that? Uh, requires lock picking too. Motherfucker, hold on. There. Now nah, can I do it? Read a document. Oh, this describe this describes a sometime burial which is a sand feathersmith, and it's a weird sequence of letters. O H L G H E. <laughs> Uh, take the object, got a key fragment, leave. I don't have a save uh, I need to get that. Loser. Oh god. I don't feel good. Are you okay? Well, look at you. Uh, Stan Loretta Minkleston. Try to eat a live eagle on a bear. I just miss mom. I just went to my mother. Sorry, Blake. The skeleton doesn't seem to be particularly 
Oh, cool. Hey, um, from the VDR2 RAM, aside from buying RAM for my sister, her computer's a DDR2 RAM, would you say G Skill is the best DDR2 RAM brand? G Skill is the best all around, no matter what version. But at certain speeds, some brands are actually better than G Skill. I was wondering about DDR2. Because with DDR3, Corsair Vengeance is the best RAM. With DDR3 RAM, so is G Skill. It really depends on. Is it Intel or AMD? Is it's an Intel motherboard. Okay. Then DDR2. go with... Yeah, then you want to go with Corsair. They're reanimating dead people, skeletons... And but this skill would be, as good, would be good too, though. Sounds horrible. Yeah, but I'm saying... So if I can't get... Can you imagine having to walk around without your skin on? No, it's like she's gonna... It's just we want to ma yeah, want to max out the RAM on her computer. Not to mention it's cold. Well, sure. Well, plus, mm. I mean, dying. For she doesn't really have any state use for it. She just wants to max out the RAM on it. Can you do something? I don't want them to find me. Also, huh. you know, Which one's the best overall? For the situation, would you? Uh, the G like just overall, would you say? Well, would you say G skill would be the best overall? No. That one guy. Yeah, you know the one. G skill is best overall, Actually, but for your situation. What uh, version of Intel are you going with? Oh, my sister has a. <laughs> she has a. Levena. It's a Levena ADS sensor, but it has an Intel motherboard in it. Guys, look at the screen heading. But she wants to upgrade. She wants more RAM so she can be able to like play through 360 or games at max settings. Guys, you should look at the screen heading. So I was thinking G-Skill? G-Skill would be better for that. Yeah. Probably <laughs> there. Careful! Guys, look at this, the, the heading. Lucky Vinny Pike, 1862. Come on, get it! Go on, get it! Not to rest, no, sooner or later. Things have the grades, so I'm ready for it. <laughs> Xavier,
Lady, but a real unfortunate name. <laughs> Nothing here but three bed rolls and a single sale smell. Uh, <laughs> White hair. Oh shit. Minus three moxie. I needed that! Talking, keep talking, keep talking. Mm -hmm. Fight. I, want <laughs> I don't have to care what happens because I have to instant one button with these guys. Oh so. Got a ring of smart thinking. To him, we got the jelly beans, please. Get your own. Where'd you get them? Some real thanks. Howdy, boss. Howdy, me stuck again. Oh, we got ourselves one hell of a canyon to get across, and no materials for bridge building. Any ideas? Well, there's an old mining town called Redwood. They opened up a lumber camp after the mines dried up. If you can fix a deal with them for the lumber we need, I can handle the engineering side of things. Where is it? I'll see what I can do. Uh, Panda, roll your eye, frighten him away. Cool. What did you say? Say, Alice, oh, there's a military cemetery near here. A territory cemetery? Territory is a military cemetery? Hush, that's important. We're talking about a very large graveyard full of skeletons of soldiers. Yeah, that could be bad. Yeah. You discovered a new map and a location called Military Cemetery. <laughs> What do you think we should do next? Here, on the 
seen it for the one where I'm being a crap hole. Any ideas? Uh, any other suggestions? We're not the skeleton. Oh, I left Bernard the skeleton there. He's probably waiting. Uh, fight him. Not all the toys. Mm. I don't have any of those toys unless you're including yourself in that mix. Mm -hmm. I always do, don't I? Uh, okay, I'll let you know when it's safe. I took care of them already. Oh, thank you. Here, you can have this worry stone. I don't need it anymore. And I think that's where I'm going to end it up for tonight. Thank you for watching. Have a good night. I have experience. Bye.